What are the biggest questions facing the defending Super Bowl champions? Hey, how are you folks? Jason Horowitz, NFL.com's Pat Kerwin. Glad to be with you here on the new segment here on CBSSports.com, the NFL Insider with Pat Kerwin, of course, Thanks, news and Jason. notes and uh, team storylines. And of course, it's all about the Steelers, Pat. And uh, when you talk about a team trying to repeat, I guess maybe you look at who they lost from that Super Bowl winning team. When you look at the, the list of deductions from this team, how big are some of those? Well, some of, there's always going to happen to teams that win Super Bowls, and the Steelers are pretty prudent with their money, so they may lose more than, than many would. Uh, the Brian McFadden loss, there's their nickelback swing starter. That's a critical player. Why? The Steelers have the lead in a lot of football games. They play more nickel defense than most teams. You're going to have to have a good, strong replacement there. That's critical. The Nate Washington, savvy third receiver, guy that, you know, now that they're in more of a spread offense, that's a critical piece. They're going to ask Lima Sweet to take that place. Now, Lima's had that famous drop last year, but he came back and had two terrific plays late in the season. I think Lima Sweet will do a nice job. Steel is a well-known, Jason, for training their young players for a year or two, and when they yep. plug them in, they play. And that would be Santonio Holmes, as we saw in the Super Bowl. When you look at their wide receivers, are they good enough as you go into this season? Well, I like, you know, Heinz Ward's getting older, and just because you gave him a small contract extension doesn't mean he can keep up with the great, excellent pace. And they've gone out, and the Sean McDonald's a terrific, savvy, older veteran guy that understands how to do things. They could still be in the market for another receiver as they approach the summer. Are you worried about the defense at all? Well, I am worried in this sense. Larry Foote was a terrific starter. Yes, it was a contractual issue and money, so they had to release him. Timmons is a great player, played a lot on third downs. He moves up. The question is, who replaces Lawrence Timmons as the backup and that role player? They didn't draft one. They didn't get one in free agency. They're a little weaker at linebacker than I like to see. But him. stronger on defensive line because they drafted Ziggy Hood, who fell down yes, at 32. Yes, and I know Ziggy Hood, yeah. and he's going to fit nicely there. Yeah. We'll see how it all plays out for the Steelers. For more on Pittsburgh, be sure to stay with CBSSports.com and check back every other week for the NFL Insider with this man, Pat Kerwin. I'm Jason Thanks, Horowitz. Jason. Take care, folks. Anytime, buddy.